Right, we're back from the hospital after a very long day. Um, everything that could go kind of our way kind of went our way today. Um, we managed to get everything that we wanted kind of resolved, didn't we? I think so, yeah. I think so, they were very good today. Yeah, they were, they were better than most people have been when we're talking to them. Uh, unfortunately, some things did go awry. But we did argue that kind of stuff with them. Uh, I managed to do a little bit of a snatch and grab of my paperwork and my results and everything. And I photographed it very quickly uh, so as I could go through it piece by piece. And then I picked it apart for the doctor, didn't I? So yeah, we discussed it with the doctor. Yeah, so we picked we picked these pieces. Of, he didn't understand a few things. Well, no, obviously, doctor, he would have understood what they meant. They were just missed. They just weren't properly explained, looked, explained by that doctor. Mm. Uh, so now we're a bit knowledge more knowledgeable about what's going on and the severity of what's going on. Uh, for me, it's very nerve-wracking and scary. How is it for you? Um, it's not easy to uh, read that information, um, but as I said before, we've just got to take a day at a time and we've just got to look at what can be done and what quality of life Daniel will have and just make the most of every day. Um, and uh, hopefully we did get a breakthrough today because Daniel's got a... Uh, a leg pain and a lump on his leg and, I, and um, we did get an immediate bone scan um, thankfully there'd been a cancellation and they fitted Daniel in straight away so that was a really good um, result today and also they said that they will contact the Marsden and between the two hospitals we're hoping to have much more of a plan forward we've uh, already uh, got one but we've got a plan plus they're gonna the, the, We've got the three bases really now, so it's it's the Marsden, uh, QE, and where we were today, isn't it? So like they're going to try and liaise to get another oncologist to do a check, as well at QE, wasn't it? That's yeah. where they want to do the other. So they're going to have another oncologist look at certain parts, but they they uh, they're looking for something in particular in my leg, which is an osteosarcoma. Uh, I had numerous scans done to my leg and um, what is it? It's, it was like a full body bone scan. I had a full body bone scan and then I had a full body bone scan and CT uh, and then they did some better images of my uh, leg and everything and they said they'll get back to us tomorrow with the results of that. So that's useful because things are progressing very fast. Um, they did in inform us that the cancer will grow very rapidly, didn't they? So they know that it grows quite quickly. Um, they know that they didn't resect my, my... My surgery needs to be all cut out again. Uh, the one in my back and my side, along with my lymph nodes. Um, so we know that has to be cut out. And then they want to look at doing some other like therapeutic treatment so the chemo radiotherapy at that point um and there, there was significance that we found out today as well wasn't there with the scan that was over a month ago that the scan a month and a half ago basically showed that uh my neck lymph nodes were enlarged uh back then um on the left side so that was actually in that set of results that we received uh, today so it's a bit weird that we're not getting all the information or it's, it's just annoying really for me I, I think now we're a little bit more um, clued up on things and we've got the milestone involved and uh, the doctors actually admitted it's so rare that they they don't know enough about it um, and we understand that because the nurse had researched it and said uh, she'd only found 20 cases worldwide so it is they were honest and said um you know we we don't know enough about this so we're just trying to work together to find the best solutions for daniel and work from now to see how 
um, we can progress. And they, they said they want to do the best by him. Yeah. And um, I certainly think that that is the case today because we've had things move quite quickly. And there's other people that we wanted to, to get in touch with and they've got in touch with us today. So um, I think that's a really good result. It is a really good result. And they gave me more pain medication, which is useful. They uh, didn't give me any. No, I've been doing her heading all day because they didn't give me I'm any so for the stressed pain out. Next yeah. to me, I'm so stressed <laughs> out. But yeah. Oh, and another thing. Everyone who's commented in the last like twenty four hours, I'm sorry that I haven't got back to you all. Uh, and everything. I'm not very well. I feel very weak. Uh, just not well at all at the moment. Um, and everyone who has donated to the GoFundMe and everything to help me to uh, look for like some solutions to this and help with like travel costs and uh, helping me personally. Uh, thank you so so much. Uh, it's an expensive business. This uh, keeping someone going who's got cancer and can't physically do much so thank you very much and yeah I'm overwhelmed by it and I'm going to try and show my mum some of the comments that you've all left for her in a <laughs> bit because she, she doesn't really understand it all uh, no. she, she doesn't know why I do these videos really she's like what but, no I'm no. not I know why you do them it's just yeah. that I'm not technologically minded Te what's that word? Technologically, uh, technologically minded. Technologically <laughs> minded. But yeah. Can't press buttons very easily that work. She presses my buttons. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, thank you everyone for your support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'm sorry it's, it's not ever good news at the moment when we do these little sit downs. But hopefully one day we'll get, get that good news and we'll be able to help you all out. But. At the moment, it it just looks like I'm going to get a bit sicker before I get better. But I'm hoping that I'll get better. We're working on it, aren't we? We mom? are. We are. We're, We're working, working hard, hard on it. Uh, and yeah, thank you. And if you want links to the community, my GoFundMe, uh, to get support or find out stuff about me, they're in the description below. If you want to leave any comments or questions for my mom. She's still with me tomorrow, so we can ask her some questions tomorrow if you want to, because uh, I can't really leave the house because I'm too sick. Uh, so, yeah, fire away, and thank you very much uh, for supporting me and watching. Thank, thank you, you, everyone. Bye. 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 Bye.